Not really the best time to put your baby on the road. You usually don't see vintage cars on the roads in Michigan this time of the year, but because of the North American International Auto Show, some classics made their way to the Motor City. The journey began in Boston and took volunteers 12 days to get here. Everett Casme joins us from Troy, the last stop before these cars make their way to Kobo. It's the final stretch. These classic cars have almost completed their journey across several states to the North American International Auto Show in Detroit. After traveling across six states over 12 days and more than 2,100 miles, these four vintage cars are here in Michigan. Their final leg of the trip to Cobo Center kicked off here at Lincoln of Troy. But the timing's perfect. You know, we're going into this weekend with, uh, you know, the kickoff with automobility. Uh, with our new brand that we have for the auto show, which has to, has to do with technology and cars. Right. And then running right into press week with all the media coming in from around the world. And then uh, and the charity preview with the big money we're going to raise for all the kids again. These three cars have taken a similar journey to the auto show in years past. You've likely seen the 57 Chevy Nomad, 61 Chrysler 300, and 66 Ford Mustang before. But new this year is the beautiful 1917 Crane Simplex Model 5. That one is specifically for the auto show hmm. because, you know, here's 2017. It's a historic year. They're going to have, for the first time at the North American International Auto Show, they're going to focus on automobility and where, <coughs> we're, and where we're going. And so we thought, well, let's show 100 years of the automobile. And all four of these automobiles got a Michigan State Police escort as they made their way along Woodward Avenue from Troy to downtown Detroit. They cruised right on in to Cadillac Square before going on display at Cobo. They're fun to drive and I, I can understand why there's such a love for the history of cars. And you can see this car and a whole lot more when the auto show officially opens to the public on January 14th. In Troy, Everett Casimir, Local 4.